Welcome back to the third part of our tutorial series. We will go over some keyboard shortcuts, advanced show editor features and give you some tips how to rapidly design big shows. Let's go! You've already worked with the effect library before. Now I want to show you some cool features that you may not have seen before. First of all, we click single firework to open the effect library window. On the right, you can change the color of the size of your desired firework. This does not change the original effect file, rather it modifies the color on the fly. On the left, you'll find the filter options for the library. This is very helpful if you want to search for a specific effect. You can filter by type of firework effect. In the box below, you can choose to see only your own effects, FWSM standard effects or downloaded effects. Below that, you can filter by the author of the effect file. If you are a Fireworks professional working with FWSN Pro, then you will see several additional filters here, including color and caliber. If you know exactly which effect or color you need in your show, you can search by keyword using the search function at the top. If you want to add several copies of the same effect into the timeline, make sure you have the option Insert Several Like This activated at the bottom right. If you already have some firework effects in your show and everything is in the right place, you might want to change some fireworks without changing the timing. To do that, simply right click your queue and choose change firework or press F2 after selected your desired queue. The effect library window will open and you can choose a different effect which replaces the effect currently used in your show. You can also select several shots in the timeline and then change the effect for all of them. If you need to fire an effect at a very precise time, you can right click and choose enter time. If you have selected several effects, then all of them will be moved to the same time. To reverse a stepper, simply press Ctrl and R. To mirror a stepper, press F3. To insert a single firework, press F. To insert a stepper, press S. You don't need to memorize these shortcuts, you can see them right next to each menu item. If you are a fireworks professional using FWSM Pro, you have access to a range of extra features. You can undo any change by pressing Ctrl and Z. After an undo, to redo the change, press Ctrl Y. You can undo and redo several changes in a row. This allows you to quickly try something new and revert it if you don't like it. You can edit your show in table format. This is also called script view. You can find this in the Tools menu. FWSM Pro provides a wide range of other features. These include automatic addressing, chains of queues, multi-monitor support, export to your firing system, label printing, Excel export, calculation of price and total explosive mass, sharing effects with colleagues and inserting shows into other shows. These will be explained in a future video. We hope that these features and keyboard shortcuts will allow you to work more efficiently and be more creative. Make sure to check out our next tutorial video in which we will look at the timeline in more detail.